I'm Becky Bitters, I'm the, I'm the costume designer of Julius Caesar, and here today we're here with all of the wigs for Julius Caesar. Um, Julius Caesar, set in a contemporary place, doesn't really seem like a wig play, um, but this production is. Um, and I'm currently actually ventilating this wig, so if you want to take a look at that. So I'm tying hair in, hair by hair by hair by hair. Um, this is for one of our wigs for Julius Caesar. Um, and this is a technique to make wigs look realistic. And that's actually really a really important thing for Julius Caesar in particular, um, because the wigs are intended to create character, and they're also intended to make um, people look like different characters. Um, so we're trying to make them as look as real as humanly possible. Um, so each of our ensemble has um, between two and three wigs um, so that they can seamlessly transition between their characters. Um, some of the wigs are shorter and sleeker. Some of them are like this one over here is like very large and curly. Um, some of the wigs are intended to look sort of like the actor's hair. Um, and some of them are, are intended to look very, very different from what the actor looks like in real life. Um, and you may say, well, why would you put a wig on someone's head where they, um, it looks just like their hair that they wear every day. Um, but the reality is if you ha only have, say, two minutes to transition between, say, a sen senator and um, townsperson, you don't have time to wrap someone's hair up and then put a wig on or take it down and make it look really nice. So we end up using wigs for each character so that we can manage it with the time that we have. Um, I love working on wigs. I love making wigs. Um, my students in my wig class are learning how to make wigs right now, which is really exciting. That's TAPS 44 if anyone wants to take it. Um, but um, I just love how it can really um, help an actor to find the different character every single time they put a wig on. And those are the wigs for Julius Caesar. So come see the play, and I want you to see if you can tell which ones are wigs and which ones aren't.